fresh garlic as well. Falafel spices. Thank you very Thank you, much. Sir. Enjoy. Best falafel place in town. If you're new to my channel, you can be notified of my latest video uploads by subscribing and pressing the all bell icon. This is the falafel I'm gonna make for you. Fresh chickpeas, and it's been overnight under the water. So don't use thin, we use fresh dried chickpeas. We leave it overnight. That's the spring onion, coriander, parsley, and garlic. That's all, we're gonna mix it up together. And you will see the green start coming down now. When it's green, it's mean nice and juicy. The falafel. Fresh garlic as well, eh? Your kitchen is so small. The whole shop is so small. I've been 12 years doing it, Yaman. I get used to it now. You've been 12 years in the shop? 12, yes. And we call it around falafel because we had shop opposite uh, Chuk Farm Road, opposite the roundhouse. The roundhouse. It's around falafel, you know what I mean? I wish you can smell that the falafel. For all this, I put like two punch of coriander, two parsley, two small garlic, and the spring onion. Nothing else? That's it. No leeks or anything? No, no, I don't put leeks. Leek is good, it's not bad. But spring onion is much better. Is this the same as how you'd make your falafel at home in Lebanon? In Lebanon, there is two parts in Lebanon. They using some. They using only chickpeas. Some they using chickpeas and uh, uh, flat beans or the five beans. They call it five beans. Yeah, five beans. So there's two things. And there is people in Egypt. They use only the the five beans. They don't use chickpeas at all. The Egyptian. But when you say chickpeas only, it will be like uh, not heavy. A lot of people ask me, how do you keep the falafel balls together without adding flour? Because most people try and make it, it breaks up and they have to add flour. How? I tell you what. They put a lot of water in it or they put a lot of soda in it. You don't use soda? Uh, I use baking powder. Alright, you're done.
Thank you, brother. You're welcome. That's all for today. If we don't finish all of them, we'll put a little bit in the fridge. Okay. For next day. All the chickpeas with the garlic, with the herbs, all together. Yeah. Spring onion and the garlic. We'll put it like mix up, down, up. We need everything mixed up together. I'm here. So this one here, it's falafel spices. It's called falafel spices. This one's baking powder. This is the secret for the fluffy. The falafel powder I'm using. Spices, abido, that's from Lebanon. And they tell you it's in it like a lot of things in it. Coriander, cumin, a bit of chili, salmon, garlic, onion, all in there. That's from Lebanon, I get okay. it. I use that one 12 years now, abido, 12 years. It's the best company so far, I see it. Thank you. So now we're gonna mix that and we're gonna fry it. And we're gonna add some water. All the spices with the salt and picking powder without water. It's dry. Yeah. No more water. Now we're ready to fry it. Okay, let's fry some falafel and we're gonna show you how it's gonna be nice and fluffy. Let's do it now. No flour, nothing inside it. Another one with sauce. That's very kind of you. Have a test, give it a try. You don't put sesame seeds? No, I don't. You got some people allergic to sesame seeds. So they will have falafel, but they're not gonna have the sauce, for example. Thank you for the taste. You're welcome. Absolutely delicious. Nice. Freshly fried, it makes a big difference. The outside is nice and crisp, and the inside, perfectly soft and fluffy. Yeah. And full of flavor. Thank you. You're welcome. And now this one with tahini sauce. Give it a try with tahini sauce and see the difference. So this is the same falafel with the tahini. Mmm, the tahini makes a big difference. It's kind of zesty, a little bit tanginess like lemon in it. And everybody asks me how you do the tahini. The secret about it is more, put more lemon. They don't put lemon in law. Absolutely delicious, thank you. You're welcome. That's halloumi cheese.
Okay, falafel cauliflower. What salad do you like? And do you want chili and tahini sauce? The salad, do you like all the salad in it? All the salad, yeah, it's perfect. And in the salad, do you like salt, lemon, pomegranate sauce? Um, can I do all three? You can, okay. all of them. This is the pomegranate. Lemon. Tahini and chili? Chili? Uh, no chili. No chili. I'll finish. And this for the lady here. Do you want a bag? Uh, that would be great. It's gonna take like three minutes. I'm gonna okay. do the falafel uh, wraps, yep. put the salad for the guys. Peppers and everything. And do you want chili sauce yes, and please. tahini sauce? Please. Thank you very much. You're welcome. I'll tell everyone about this place. <laughs> I'll always tell everyone about this place. The most fantastic falafel wrap. Beautiful. Thanks. Nice one. Oh my god, I'm a fan. <laughs> Travel over and then put it in the cash while I'm driving fast. I couldn't stop. Now we're going to show you another secret. Secret, the, the, the tahini must be inside the falafel. Again, one, two.
Thank you very Thank you, much. Sir. Enjoy. Best falafel place in town. Take Thank care, you. my friends. God bless.